they were in charge, they were in the over busy Saturday evening busy. Aro busy bar Thursday evening mau that busy Wednesday eh so busy Wednesday just just power jam we I mean it's all very busy so dunia dia kalah tu we are busier than God what hello welcome back to this disciple of Christ family uh, I'm coming after a long time now ekta ene bohi aslo Bible devotion lo igine ene bohi aslo Bible puri igine ekta kotha monote ahise moi to gudi mule moi bhabi aslo apna logo our subscribers are just up and down, sometimes up, sometimes down. So whatever it is, my dream is to reach out uh, with the God, word of God. That's all. You know, subscription, like, comments. These are important, but most importantly, please understand the content that I'm uh, trying to create. So please uh, do support and help uh, my ministry to spread out. Yeah, I. I'm here to share a thought with you, which I was just reflecting on my devotion. It is about coming to church. Whose loss it is if you don't go to church? Or I'm a youth pastor and there are pastors who are watching at this video. This is for the church members. Church members, church members can to do the month. When you don't go to church, you don't have church, you don't have car loss. Whose loss do you think it is? Important thing is this question. Because uh, churches are becoming empty. And especially when it comes to youth services, we don't want to go to church. Church is not going We have lots of excuses, you know. Church time the emergency come. Church time the hey. Uh, down or calm like and we have lots of hundreds of excuses to make. Whose loss do you think? The car loss. Let me tell you, number one, the loss is you are bringing loss for yourself. the loss for us, number one. How? Going to church means listening to the word of God. If you remember Mary and Martha, you know, both of them invited Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ uh, went to their home and Jesus said, listen, your sister is, has chosen the best thing in life. See, in life, you know, to, to understand and to listen to the word of God is the beauty of our life. That is part of our worshiping God. But we don't have time to go to church. I'm not time to church we pretend as if we are busier than God. Yeah, we do that. I mean, it's all probably busy acting more. Sometimes I think shame on us, you know. But uh, this is the reality of life. My point is, if you don't go, when, when you don't go to church, the loss is for yourself. You are bringing loss uh, on yourself. Black man can equal loss nine. Abna niyo can loss. Aro number two the pastor, youth leader, woman pastor, andro can be loss. The reason is because they prepare and come. And the jiman par andro se par prepare kuri kine ahe. Jite apni na ahe. Church the jite pastor preparation the lot loss khau. The rest, ami ministry ji kore, abna niyo can e kore. That's my point. And in fact, pastors are very very So be very very careful in your life when you choose. You know, emergency kam mulai apna dewar din ne. Emergency kam mulai apna univar goodly. Emergency kam mulai apna you know women fellowship te jaole kani. What kind of life you uh, life you are living? This shouldn't be in our life. Busy. We act busy as if we cannot give time to God or so. Come on, how can we be a person if we don't give time to listen to the word of God? Keep in mind, yeah, thank you so much for listening to this short talk. I believe this will help us to understand uh, the importance of going to church. Thank you.